Hi guys, today I'm going to review on Sky RC IMAX B6 version 2. Eh? Okay, so I just bought it. Okay, let's open it up. So what we have here, we got the charger, we have cables, okay, so let's look at the cable first, so cable for uh, XT60 to DIN type. And we also have with no connection XT60 and also a cable, crocodile cable clip. And also include manual. Okay. So now let's look into the charger itself. Huh? So this is IMAX B6 version 2 Sky RC. So on the left side we have the charger port and also the power. Yeah, I think this is the power port to power up the charger and the output should be over here. Okay, if you open this we have the output and also the balance port and I think this is the temperature port. Okay. So let's try to switch this on. So for the charger, it uses input 240 volt and the output should be 15 volt, 6 ampere. Okay. So I already put this input 15 volt. So basically, you can use adapter up to 18 volts to supply for this charger. And I also have a cable here so we can. So it did it is not use this kind of pin. So it use XT60. So I have to use this one to plug it here. Okay, now we have the output. So this is the input. So the old one use this kind of banana plug. But for the new version 2, it uses XT60 for the output pin. And then for the balance, can we use it? The normal cable, so I think should be any problem. To plug it here, so it fits well. And then for the temperature sensor, I bought it separately let's try to connect it so if you look at this this is the sensor temperature sensor and there's a strap so that you can strap it to the battery to the lipo battery and this is the pin, so you just connect it like this. So temperature, balance, and also the output. Okay. So let's let's try to switch this on. So we can change. I think the battery type, similar like the old one. So we try to charge the lipo battery. Enter. So we can change the uh, is it balance, charge, storage, discharge. So I'm going to charge this 3S battery. It's an XT60. So I'll just have an adapter here to connect it. And then we have a balance connector over here 
and then lastly we put a temperature sensor on top of the battery okay so let's try to charge it so this is 3s with enter first and then change oh sorry this is 2s oh it's okay uh i'll draw usually charge it half of the uh, capacity so this is 0 0.3 so i just put 0. Point, uh, this is 1.1350 uh, ma so i just put 0 0.6 enter and then change the uh, battery uh, type is it 2s or 3s this is 3s so enter and then we hold it so it says there 3 3 series 3s so it's okay just enter oh battery check confirm enter okay that's all so you can see that this is the current current capacity of the battery so 50% charge and then this is the voltage 11.55 volts usually for 3S it go, will go to up to 12 point uh, 12.6 I think volt so we just have to wait so for the battery it is best if we place it inside a lipo guide bag Uh, like this one you can buy it from Shopee so if anything happen to this battery if it's want to explode it's in, explode inside the bag here okay so let's look at the difference between the older version the version 1 and also the version 2 of the IMAX B6 so if you look at the size it's quite different okay and if you look at the output side, so the balance charger is much bigger compared to uh, to this one, and the output port is different. It use um, XT60, and this one is a banana type. And for the temperature, if you look at this, it's at this side, but at the older one, it's at, at the left side, at the uh, power supply. And other than that, I think I bought this new one because the button is not okay. There's a problem with this. For example, we choose a lipo. So I think it's quite the same. And how we charge it. So the function is the same, you can still charge using the version 1. But for the version 2, I think there might be a different function, uh, additional function, and also the size is quite smaller compared to this one. Okay. And for this, for the weight is, I think it's the same weight. Okay. So for a normal charging, lipo battery charging, I think both is doing a great job. You can... Uh, if you want a cheaper one, you can buy this uh, version one. I think it's around ninety to eighty ringgit from Shopee. For IMAX, is, uh, version two is quite expensive. I bought it around hundred and fifty in uh, in Shopee also. Okay, so it depends on you. I think if you just want to do a normal charging. Lipo charging, I think, and not lipo storage. I think this version one is, I think, it's also enough. 